Hey guys, welcome back to Avor in the spaceship building, mining, the combating solar system spanning. I don't know, it's it's a huge game, guys, and hi and welcome. My name is Twitchy, and we are here doing a little bit of mining at the moment. Uh, last time we went around, and we actually did a little bit of a trek across quite a... a, a, a a wide section of the galaxy but of course as always that was actually a very small section of the galaxy and I've noticed that we've got a lot of these exclamation marks kicking around and I would like to go and try and figure those out well, they've been there for a while and I feel like we are finally at the point where we can probably just a little bit handle ourselves in combat but with that end I want to uh, show you something that I completely missed last time if I press the L button turns out that I've got a whole bunch of mail that I didn't know you can also press the, the little um, button up in the top right here, the little icon, uh, it'll bring this up. Uh, combat instructions was something that we were doing, this dangerous uh, galaxy is a dangerous place, attach one or more turrets and then uh, destroy a, a turret, uh, a pirate turret, sorry. Uh, we went and did that, we were like, yeah, great, so we did that. He also wants to do us some trading, but we'll, we'll talk about that later. But when we did the, the combat and we blew up our first pirate, he also sent us a bit of mail that has these double chain gun turrets as a reward for that, that mission there, so great, I'm going to take these. I'm not actually going to put them on this ship though because I noticed that the Lady Adventurous only has one turret and we want to uh, want to beef that up a little bit. Oh no, we did put two on there. Well, I want to put more on anyway. I believe this one is a chain gun and over here... Oh, where's the point defense? I was fairly sure we had some point defense somewhere. I must have put it on the greatest escape. Okay, well anyway, with that in mind, let's go ahead and put one of these up here. We will, Can it do it? Not enough slots for arm turrets. Install the system upgrade for your ship to increase the number of turret slots. Okay, we can totally do that. We need to go and find somewhere to buy it though. Uh, do we want to upgrade any of these? This is, this is really the question. If, if this is the max we've got, let's have a look. The chain gun rare, damage per second, 37.2 uh, over here. 43.4, yes, we want to get rid of this one. Not quite the 58, unfortunately. Let's have a look at that. We've got a 30 there, 43. Uh, yeah, yeah, okay. This this is the best turret to slap on here. I mean, I'm almost tempted to take this one off and uh, have a matching set. It's not quite as much damage. No, no, we'll, we'll put the maximum damage there because this computer better than me. If the combat last episode displayed anything, it was my inability to shoot a moving target. So it's probably a good idea to put the, the biggest weaponry on the computer ship because they can shoot a moving target. I'm just going to wait around for 10 minutes or so. Let this guy go around and do a little bit more mining, though. I am looking around and noticing that there are still a lot of asteroids around. My main plan, as I say, is to jump up through the gate network and go and have a look at these uh, these missions over here. I've also had a request to go and have a look at the station building process. I don't think I'm going to have enough money, but it's, uh, it's, it's almost the same as making a ship, so we will check. we will look at that on the way past. Uh, you know what, that's that's enough. Let's get hold of you, F. Uh, orders, follow me, escort me, thank you very much. And then you over there, you seem to have stopped following me when I started jumping around in the different ships earlier. Escort me as well. All right, beautiful. I, I have noticed that there is a little bit of a bug in the game where if you've got two ships following you, they can end up trying to, uh, to literally fight for the same spot. They will try and bump into each other and then one will take offense from that. Whichever one got rammed will take offense and start laying shots into the other one who doesn't doesn't retaliate because there's the same part of the team or something. I don't know. It's weird, weird uh, coming together of different mechanics to mean that one ship exp uh, one ship fights and the other doesn't. It, it's strange. Astral Legacy Alpha, and of course, means that one of your ships gets blown up, and that's that's not what you want. That's never what you want. Every time I look, the Lady Adventurous is doing a lot better than my little mining ship back there. Despite the fact that the mining ship is just a hole with a with an engine on it. it. Surely it should be moving a little bit better than that. Surely. One thing I've been thinking whilst flying around in this uh, empty void over here is in simulations like this, what I call Newtonian space, but I'm sure that's not actually the correct term for it. Uh, it's, it's just a place that what well, gravity doesn't exist. You know, like these these asteroids, you could leave them here for like simulated trillions of years and they would never move in towards each other. But we have situations with like a planet forming over there and I wonder how, how a universe like this would actually end up forming because you would still have matter bumping into each other from random movements from, you know, just, just random movements, you know, th things 
started off with like some sort of uh, uh, some sort of expansion so there'll be some sort of maybe quantum fluctuation that imparts a tiny tiny little bit of movement into something and then that crashes into something else electrostatic forces come into play as long as they didn't hit into each other too hard they will end up joining together so you would get conglomerations of stuff like this if there was no no gal uh, no gravity but would you get a planet I could definitely see that type of galaxy, that type of universe, sorry, existing just as like a diffuse nebula of nothing bigger than coffee granules. I want to go north here. Look how this, ga this gate line... Can I zoom in anymore? It turns out I can't zoom in anymore. This gate line over here comes and lines down this way, and this one goes up. I'm wondering whether they're going to meet up in this inside point here with the unknown energy signature. I want to go find out. Is, are you the north one? Let's have a look. You're on the northeast gate. There's a north gate somewhere. That one over there? Yeah. Now, in a gravityless society, would would, would, would would the friction end up winning out? I mean, these are questions I need to ask. And also, I need to ask you over there, can you please mine around here? I want I want this in particular mined, and I don't know whether it's going to come directly for that or go for the iron underneath. Well, we'll just wait and see what happens with this guy, shall we, right? There we go. Second asteroid he went for. Beautiful. Beautiful. Always after more titanium. Always. Of course, without gravity, a black hole just wouldn't be a thing. It would just be a big lump of stuff. Yeah, you know, would you get to some sort of new horizon where uh, the electromagnetic forces became too strong for even its own self to get out? I don't, I don't know. It's like the the whole the whole concept of a gravityless universe is it's quite an interesting one, if you ask me. Answers on a postcard if you happen to have higher degrees in uh, astrophysics or something and can help me with this stuff. Okay, let's have a look. Where are we? Yeah, we're exactly where I thought we'd end up. Is it just a, a straight through, though? It's just a corridor. There isn't, like, a, an extra... No, we've got an east, east, northeast, and we've got wherever we just left from, this one, the south one. Oh, hey, who are you? Equipment dog. Do you have... Let's have a look and see what they've got. Trade equipment. Hi, how are you doing? I, I really want the trading system. Yeah. Do you also have a turret control system? That's only a plus one, unfortunately. I want to, I want to look for something. Oh, here we go. What have you got? A plus two. That's all my money. No, that's more than all my money. Six minutes. We could we could sell a bunch of stuff and get this right. Turret slots plus two, and then we'd have. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna totally do that. All right, here we go. First first trade of the play session. Resource dock. Let's go and just sell a whole bunch of our iron. We've got like sixty three bits, sixty three thousand tons, whatever unit that is of iron. So uh, yeah, let's let's do that. Up in the top left. Let's get rid of it. Okay, at the high qua resource dock over here, let's go and sell ourselves some um, resources. Yeah, I want to. I want to sell this. All right, sell to the station. Uh, we can sell 4.2. Let, let's just drop. Is 40 going to be enough? Yeah, let's let's drop 10,000, and hopefully that will then give me 71 grand up top. That should then be enough to go and buy that that unit I wanted. Hey, excuse me, excuse me. Limited time offer. I want your limited time offer. Thank you very much. Hello, resource equipment dog, not resource dog. We literally just left the resource dog. Yes, I would like to trade equipment. I would like to buy that. Thank you very, very, very much. That's exactly what we wanted. What are you guys doing back there? Hey, hey, you two need to calm down, all right? If you don't calm down, I'm going to break you up. I'll send you off to a different sector and you can go salvage stuff. Just be calm, all right? I've got stuff to do. Whew. All right, P, uh, I think we need to go to the systems and I definitely need to pull. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Before we do it, let's, let's just do a hot swap if we can. Okay, there we go, beautiful. Because if I'd pulled that one out, we would have lost one of the turrets off of our, our craft. Uh, it would have been awkward. Would have been very, very awkward. We do have now two things. What's this internal defense weapon system? Permanent installation only. Ow. Uh, internal defense weapon system as internal. Okay, I'll fight off enemy borders. Okay, that's not what I want. I tell you what I do want to want I do want to do though is go over to the lady adventurous over here because she also needs some upgrades. Okay, so she's got two slots. Nice, nice, nice. That's cool. Uh, so the turret control system, uh, that's probably all I want to give her for now. Unless we find something like a power system or uh, some more turret control systems, then that will probably do it. But with that, we can totally, 
totally drop another turret on the top here. Another of the double chain guns by the looks of it. Okay, well, this this is totally when we, like, destroy that one. Well, not destroy. Destroy might be a bit of a strong term there, but we put that one on the side, and then we've got the matching ones either side. Can, uh, is this not selected? Is is there is there a problem here? Uh, yeah, all right. Well, I didn't like it for some reason. Not entirely certain why, but there we go okay now with that we totally have a situation where we do not have enough energy being made so we need to think about how we're going to address this and i feel like we can add a small generator somewhere so let's open this up we have of course been mining some titanium so we'll get the energy container no 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 we want the generator and can we can we just replace something is that like what's the, what what is that what have i just selected is there a way to see what i've just selected okay iron hole this middle section of iron hole vanilla block with windows why do i want the windows Psh, whatever can you please swap that out okay what happens there it's not quite enough not quite enough. Let's see if we could, there's more that we can do. So that's crew quarters. That's a little awkward. There's some more hole back here. Let's do that as well and hopefully that'll be enough. Obviously it would have been much nicer to put them together. No, still more going on up there. Okay, so let's uh, let's actually replace something in the middle here. So th that's a cargo bay. I want to find something else that I can swap in, uh, swap these crew quarters for. Because we need the crew quarters. Let's be honest. We, we, we totally need those. There's an inertial dampener as well. Hmm. I'm going to play around with it for a bit. I want to get another generator and some uh, move, then keep the number of crew that we've got. That's, that's the important bit, right? Okay, so I went for the uh, the cross shape of the hull in the top here, created a whole bunch of generators out of that. Seems to have worked out all right for us. Okay, cool. Moving on. That was quite a diversion and I liked it. Uh, that whole time I should have totally left this uh, this mining craft to go and do stuff and follow me around, uh, not to follow me around, to go around mine. That that would have been a much smarter plan. Much, much. He didn't, he didn't need to sit here and watch us do this. Oh, we're back here with the bouncing mining mining stations and the wormhole. Okay, cool, cool. At least I know where I am. I think on the way back, I'm going to try my best to take alternate routes. If I can go, like, out and around this way, that would be great. Yeah, let's try that. We're going to go north. We're going to go... Hey, 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 guys, guys, guys. Calm, calm, please, calm. North gate, Golden Knight 2. Let's do it. Okay, I've arrived at a fairly central uh, sector located amongst all of these exclamation marks. I've sent my mining ship off, and I think I'm going to use this place as a little bit of a uh, home sector, if you will. A little little fort, a fortification, somewhere to, to get going and move from. I've not really had a look at what's around. Wire manufacturers, lots of wire manufacturers by the looks of it. Uh, this must be somewhere... Uh, what, do they, what do they want trade-wise? I bet it's... I bet it's copper. I bet it's copper. Gold, plastic, and steel. Three things that I don't know where you get from. Okay, so we, me and the Lady Adventurous, we're going to try and find our way over to this sector here. Uh, enter coordinates into the navigation system. Now, this really should have worked the way that I did it last time. Uh, it's calculating the route, please. Jump route calculate. So we fly towards this and get up at full speed. Now I press space. And then, do I hammer? No, I just hammered space a few times and it worked. <laughs> Why was that so much trouble last time? All right, so we were here being like, hey, how's it going? What is this? You are flying through clear space. Hyperspace recharge speed is increased. So there was nothing here. Mission, emergency call. Um, I mean, I'm looking around, seeing to see. Let's press F9. Anything at all. Pirates are attacking the sector. Uh, how, how bad? Let's have a look at the Omicron rating over there. Um, oh, I feel... I feel I feel scared and I'm not sure whether I should. I don't see an Omicron rating. That's the problem. Well, are we committed? I mean, the, the, the Lady Adventurers is committed. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. I don't know if I can actually do this the way that I want to, but we're going to have to go get involved. Lady Adventurers, why did you just go screaming in there? That's very not helpful. Uh, what am I firing with here? I'm getting a lot of ones. There we go. Bam, 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 bam. Am I taking damage? I'm not entirely sure. I'm trying to just kind of do some strafing shots. That's a good hit there. Being shot by this guy, so let's try and take him out again. I'm kind of just going sideways if I can. Just feels a little bit better. There seems to be a bunch of salvage going on. Uh, yeah, just the general, like, random tapping of the different buttons. I'm actually getting a little bit damaged here no no real problem though by the looks of it no real problem should definitely try and focus on this guy a little bit if i can uh okay that that's going incredibly well actually incredibly well maybe i should try and uh 
back up the lady adventurers rather than picking on new targets that would probably actually work out a lot better i'm not feeling any sort of uh, tactics to this particular battle just uh, point and go by the feel of it just point no lady adventurous no how do i get her to back out as quick as possible i'm not not actually certain if that's a thing i can do i need i need like some quick quick buttons for stuff you know uh quick quick retreat key or something like that if everything's going really bad i could tell the lady adventurous to just run away i'm not sure if that's a thing if, it, if it's not a thing in the game, I hope someone's made a mod for it. Bam, bam, bam. Okay, that's good. I, I, I've got a fighter achievement. I don't know what that means. Well, it means that I've done some fighting, but does it mean that I'm good at the fighting? I don't know. I don't feel like I'm particularly good at fighting. Though we did just take out, like, four or five ships compared to my... Can, can we back up out of this? Thanks, thanks very much. Uh, trying to try to just strafe around. Woo wee Okay, that, that was our first proper combat experience there. Wow. Wow, all right, I'm about that. I'm about that. All right, wh where are you? Hi, you. You don't look like you're having a good time. Can we um, press F to interact? I want to go order. Just uh, quickly do, do a bit of a salvage. Where's the salvage? I saw it there somewhere. Okay, whilst you do that, I'm also going to go do this. I've got no uh, cargo space, so I can't pick up the solid things. Uh, but I think I could probably pick things up like you see those yellow credits floating around That's something I can go and grab um, Right, okay. This this is this will be fine. This will be fine Ooh, blowing up some trash. I can't got myself a new turret of some description a mining turret. I mean uh, great I suppose <laughs> Ooh, we got a yellow over here. What what could this possibly be? It's gonna be a wonder for us. It's gonna be amazing. It doesn't is it a turret? It looks like it might be a turret. Oh yeah. It's a double chain gun turret. Beautiful, beautiful. Ooh, there's a bunch of systems that have just been left over here. Let's go and see what we've got. Got ourselves another turret, a double chain gun turret, uh, another double chain gun turret, and that one over there. Let's go and have a look. Oh, let's just get close enough to find out. Oh, it's a system. I could do with some systems. It's a turret control system. Beautiful. Beautiful. I think I think that's probably enough now. I'm feeling a little bit, little bit vulnerable. Yes, the 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 lady adventurous is going around blowing up all the scrap and trying to see if we're getting anything decent out of it i mean that is still quite a large bit of wreckage let's be honest here but i yeah i i feel like we've we've pushed our luck already just hanging around this long the thing that i am confused about is the exclamation point still there so what, what are we supposed to do about that I mean, on here we've got the uh, the, the grayed out coordinates, 259381. Is that where we are? Oh, yeah, 259381. We're definitely here. There's just nothing around. Okay, okay, let's do it. F orders, escort me. We're going to go back over to here. Ooh, can I uh, add coordinates into the nav computer? Thanks very much. And we're going to get out of here. We're going to make ourselves this target over here. Beautiful. Jump route calculator. Please stand by. Let's get going fast and then just press it again or something. There we go. Still not sure what the exact button combination is. Oh, arriving back to the sector and our sensors are pick up a short burst of subspace signals. That's not great. In fact, that is quite aggressive where is our a uh, little mining ship he's around somewhere our oh, lady adventures we need to get you to a repair dock and we need to get you to one now can we do that from here or do we have to oh it's a turret factory nice let's press f9 and have a look uh doesn't look like we can actually do it from from here there's no shipyard no repair dock okay i'm gonna i'm gonna do it the very very expensive way if i can going into the build menu i'm gonna click repair uh let's let's see what happens here bam i've got i've got all the materials that's amazing wonderful let's get back in the greatest escape because i think if we so if we hang around for too long, we're going to get inundated with a Zotan, and I believe them to be actually a little bit, little bit of a threat. Incidentally, our little mining ship over here has been w working away for so long. Oh, it's it's 
picked out all the asteroids, has cleaned out all the asteroids, beautiful, but I was about to say it's also gone and got itself, uh, gone and got our iron stocks back up to full. I think this might mean that we, uh, we abandon this place and try and find somewhere a little bit more, um, well, with, 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 uh, with a shipyard, actually, that's what we want. Okay, let's try this northwest, it might even take us up there. Let's ignore the Zotan coming in, I mean, if anything, they're gonna be focusing on me, right, rather than the sector. I don't actually know, I don't actually know. Honestly, this one isn't much better. Let's have a look at where we are on the map. Uh, we are a little bit more within everywhere. Can can we please not show that again? Thanks very much. Uh, we are in a little bit more within all the markers, but at this point, I've noticed that we got to about a 20-minute episode. Not, not quite. It's a little bit shorter than that. Uh, but I'm going to ask you guys a quick question here. Maybe if I even remember, stick a poll up into the top right. Do you guys like shorter or longer episodes of this? Uh, obviously, with the shorter episodes, I could probably knock them out about two a week, but the, the longer ones about once a week. So, uh, so let me know. The shorter ones will be like this. We'll move across the galaxy, do a mission, or something like that, and, uh, oh, let's have a look and see if we can even, can we even, right, you, you, you need to go somewhere else, can we just tell you to mine, will that keep you safe, I don't think it will, alright, let's do that, are the corvettes, the corvettes are attacking, let's go do it, so yeah, if you guys could give me a little bit of feedback there, uh, I've noticed that this is, uh, one of the ones that a lot of people are watching, so I'd like to, like to get the feedback as, as well as possible because it's obviously not entirely all my my audience that i'm used to so uh yeah let me know let me know all right let's go in and have a look and see what's going on here we don't have an omicron rating on this i'm not sure entirely why uh some ships give us some an omicron rating some don't um i'm not really seeing anywhere that i can even shoot at uh are we are we just are we gonna turn up just to see all the all the salvaging because don't get me wrong that would be fire. Oh, in fact, we can we can boost. I completely forget about the boost quite often because I'm travelling around with slower ships than myself. Uh, I, I try to. There we go. I got some shots in. Did you? I, I definitely got some shots in there. You guys saw that, right? Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, because I'm travelling with slower ships than myself, I quite often uh, forget to boost around just so they can keep up. With that, I am going to say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure, ladies and gentlemen. I will see you guys next time. Well, we're going to go ahead and try and figure out, was it here? Where, where were my missions? We're going to figure out what this trading instruction one is all about. I, I, I feel like that's the next step before we go on and have a look at actual stations themselves. Because hopefully, learning about trading will teach us all about how to make a lot of money very quickly. But I will see you then when we're going to do that. Bye.